What's up dudes? My name is Nick. Welcome back for another music video reaction. Today we are looking at the brand new song from Reigns titled Turn It Up. Turn It Up. This one's coming like three months after their most recent release which was titled uh, Juliet which was a really fun sort of song to listen to. I definitely liked it. So I'm always you know, one, just because it's new music, I'm interested in hearing what this is all about. Not to mention, on top of the fact that Juliet was a pretty good song. So, we're going to do what I do in all my videos. I'm going to see what Turn It Up is all about. I'm going to give you guys my honest first impression, thoughts, and opinions on it. To tell you what I liked about it, and also to tell you what I didn't like about it. So, if that is something that you guys are interested in hearing more of... In the future as a cover future k-pop releases then please do consider clicking the subscribe button down below so with all of that being said let's get the video started okay, music music video set the post-apocalyptic world. What does it mean? It just means that there's that the music video is set in a abandoned building. <laughs> okay. I dig that little build up into the first verse as like the intro to kind of like amp up the intensity but then like nah just kidding we're not really gonna do that for a minute at least we're gonna hold off on the intensity for a little bit for like 30 seconds That's okay. All right, this song is. I, I was gonna say the same as, as as Juliet, but I would say it's. Okay, never mind. We're gonna take what I was about to say back. I wasn't gonna say it was the same, like in actuality, but. Well, that was an interesting little bridge thing, whatever they want to call that. Huh. I dig this. I like this a lot. This is another, another good song from them. I'm really enjoying... I am enjoying this song quite a lot damn you remember was it two three years ago when like the yeah the dubstep's back <laughs> okay <laughs> uh, I can get down with that Um. Okay, but I was gonna say, remember when that? Remember when the dubstep breaks were like a thing in in K-pop, and that was a uh, something that happened pretty frequently in music. Reigns is bringing that in this one. Okay. Okay, all right, dude, this is... Oh, 
Okay, that was all right. That was that was also that was like I said a very very good song. So I was I said that this was kind of I was gonna say I got I was gonna say something along the lines that this song is good in the same way that Juliet was, or I was gonna say in my mind at least, right? It was like this is the same as Juliet, but it's not the same because it's obviously it's a very much different sound and style. Um, but what I was really thinking in my, in my mind was that this is I like this for the same reason that I like Juliet, and that it's just a fun solid song to listen to um of course in this one they're bringing some more interesting stuff in this as far as you know like that dubstep breakdown which has been which was a thing in k-pop like probably what in in 2013 2014 something like that you know dubstep in k-pop was uh was a thing especially when it came to came to breakdowns and you know that was something that was you know cool so it's cool to see it back uh for at least one song it's very very cool and of course you know, sometimes we're, it, it does bring in a, you know, a new genre of influence to kind of break up what has been, you know, influencing, what has been heavily influencing K-pop over the last years when it comes to, you know, EDM genres. So bringing in something that's a little bit different when it comes to EDM to influence the music is always something that I will welcome. And so I'm super, super, I guess, happy super glad super i think it's a you know two thumbs up for them to to like bring that sort of influence into this song um you know and then and of course the the big thing which is again kind of a reason why i like it but also it makes it sort of some somewhat similar to juliet except for the fact that it's a completely different genre of music you know juliet was more of a retro feeling kind of like an electronic i, I guess funk kind of song um you know, whatever, it's a very good song, it's a completely different, it's got a much more, you know, retro vibe to it than this song does, um, where this song's got something that's a little bit more, I guess, dark, I don't know if that makes any sense, I don't know if that's really accurate, but, you know, or maybe my, maybe my view and my, you know, viewpoint on the song being dark is kind of clouded by, you know, that breakdown part, and also the, the little bridges of the transitions that happened after the choruses that kind of have shaped to the thing. And those, those parts right there that kind of bring a little bit of that dark edge to the song is, I think, what makes this with this one interesting to listen to. Otherwise, if they hadn't actually added those parts and they hadn't actually really, you know, if that hadn't been a part of the song, then I might say like, yeah, this song is really fun and I love this song, you know, and it, it's really great, you know, the upbeat nature of it and the beat and the music and all of that stuff is you know, a lot of fun and is really, really great. And I got swept away by the flow of the song. But ultimately, it's going to be a song that, you know, the more that I listen to it, then the less that I'm going, it's going to be like a go-to song to listen to. But they did add those couple of moments in the song to add a little bit of spice to it, to, to change things up, to make things more interesting. And those are the moments in this song that have kind of, um, I guess, sealed the deal for me, so to speak, that I've, you know, kind of categorized or that I will say that this is a good song. And this is going to be one that I definitely think for a little bit longer than maybe that I otherwise would have, like if they were not included. But those have kind of, if to me, kind of, um, what am I trying to say? Extended the, 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 like the shelf life, the, how the, the longevity of that song, like how long it is going to be a, a song that is at the front of my mind that I will be thinking about when I'm starting off a, a, a like a listening session or when I get in my car and I start on my playlist. It's going to be at the front of my mind just purely because of those moments in the song, because they add a little bit of, you know, variety to what would otherwise be something somewhat bland I guess you could say not really bland but you know not the most interesting and groundbreaking song in the world so you know Reigns definitely um I, I know I saw it because I just looked um you know when as I got this song off with this video off YouTube um that there that Juliet got a million views so you know Reigns is definitely you know making making a name for themselves and they continue to grow they continue to put out good music so I'm super happy to see that they're not you know taking in my opinion at least taking a step backwards with the music that they release and you know I think that this one will be an equally successful song for them as their previous song was and as everything else that they've released um has been as well so um, that's all I got to say. I want to know what you guys have got to say, of course, down in the comments below. So share whatever it is that you think, whether you like this song or not. Like, don't be afraid to share any of your opinions because this community that I'm trying to build is all about having some free and open discussion about our thoughts and opinions, no matter what they are. So if 
that is a community that you guys are interested in becoming a part of, then please do consider clicking on the subscribe button down below. And if you want to stay updated with everything that I'm doing on this channel 24 seven, click on the bell icon so you can turn notifications on so you can, so you will never miss a single video from now into the future. So that's going to be it for this video. As always, I want to thank you guys for watching and I will see you all next time.